What's up everyone, my name is Chris, welcome to the Like Sneaker channel. In this episode, I'll be talking about a sneaker con based in Birmingham rather than my usual sneaker review. The sneaker con is hosted by Crep City, which is one of the largest sneaker and lifestyle event across Europe. And in UK this year, they have already hosted in London and Manchester. The one held in Birmingham was back on Saturday the 10th of September in a building called Secret Space, located within the cultural quarter known as Digbeth. The event ran from 12 o'clock noon to 6 o'clock. A standard ticket cost £10 and early admission cost £15, which allows access from 11 o'clock. I bought the standard ticket online and got there around 11.50 and there were probably around 20 people ahead of me and there was a bit of delay in letting us in. After waiting between 15 to 20 minutes, we got in and around this time there were already 30 people queuing behind us. To be honest, I didn't capture much video footage. It's just a few snippets to give everyone a flavour on the day. Anyway, let's head straight to the slideshow and I'll provide my thoughts near the end. In total, I spent around 1 hour and 20 minutes and around 1 o'clock in the afternoon, I would say there were approximately 200-300 people. What I liked about this event is that there is a diverse age range, almost like a family community feel to it. Based on the other videos I saw on YouTube, this event is rather small compared to those in London and Manchester. The music level was perfect in keeping the place upbeat and not being too loud. Food choices were limited with pieces and crepes, 
but Big Beth is a street food haven, so you definitely have more choices nearby. A lot of heat were out on display, especially with the rare and hyped SB Dunks. Unsurprisingly, Nike and Jordan dominated around 60% that were on display. I was probably the only one wearing ASICs. However, I did get two complimentary shout out on my seven toes, which brightened up my day. By the time we left, a queue was forming outside. All in all, although it wasn't big, but it was a pleasant experience and it wasn't overcrowded or overheated. For this occasion, I would give it a solid seven. Thanks for watching this video. I know it was brief as I want to spend more time on the event itself rather than trying to drown myself with producing content. And hopefully I'll improve on the content delivery for the next event. Please feel free to like and subscribe and do leave comments if you did attend the Birmingham event. I would like to know what were your honest thoughts about it. And I'll see you in the next video.